Hi, Cancer. So this is going to be your February end of the month reading. I hope you guys are doing well. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support. Excuse my nails. I am moving stuff around. So my nails are looking a little dusty right now. Um, I am open for personal readings right now as well. So if you guys do want to do candle work with me or readings, email me. Um, I do have my specials still going. I do money, love, um, open road, better business. I do reversals. I do taking off black magic, all that good stuff. Um, just email me. I'll be leaving everything in the description down below. I also do have my $5 cash app questions via email only. So let's get into the reading. I am using the Broken Mirror Oracle deck. Looks like this. Shout out to Jamie. She got me um, this Oracle deck. If you guys want to check her out, um, her video um, channel, sorry, not her video. Her channel is Jamie Zebra 23. Um, yeah. So if you guys do want to check her out and show her love, not hate, <laughs> um, go check her out. I love this um, tarot card she gifted to me. So thank you so much. Love you so much. Okay, so we did get cold shoulder. So I feel like maybe you've been distanced with someone. Maybe you guys had a breakup. Maybe you guys went on a trip. And this trip kind of showed you we should break up. I ain't feeling it. Maybe you guys got into a fight. I had to do something. And you guys are just giving each other the cold soldier. soldier shoulder. Soldier. Why did I say that? Um, let's see what else. This one flew out. Yeah, determination. I feel like you're still holding on. Maybe this person is going to come towards you and be like, you know what? I'm not taking no for an answer. It's going to be very, very persistent. Um, it's going to want to give you gifts, flowers. Going to give you something for sure. Um, due to this cold shoulder vibe. Like, maybe they did break up. Like, you guys did break up. And they're trying to get you back with that. Let's see what else for my cancers. Let's see what else. It says distractions. So I feel like there's a lot of temptation around or you work in an environment where there's a lot of temptation or this person works where there's a lot of temptation. But I feel like this is a busy setting. So maybe you're always on your feet or you're always busy. Um, but I feel like this person has a lot of distractions as well. Maybe they're like cheating vibes. Maybe you saw something through their phone and you're just like, what the hell? Um, but I feel like it was on this person's time. They always kept you waiting. They always kept you wondering. They were never really being sincere. They were always playing games. They were always hot and cold. Even on this trip, maybe you guys were like, maybe you thought this trip would tie the knot and it just untied the knot. So we also did get intimacy. So I feel like there's a lot of passion there. Maybe when, and it's a sexual passion, um, but you do feel like there's chemistry there. I feel like you do want to make this long term, get married, become a union together. Let's see what else. I feel like you're trying to make it work or someone's trying to make it work with you. But I feel like whoever this is, this is someone for sure missing you since you are in separation with this person. They could be crying. They could be looking at your pictures. I feel like they are going to come towards you for sure, though. Um and express their feelings. I'm almost getting with the caught card and the message and thinking of you and all this um, energy. I'm almost getting like the Faith and Evans um, Biggie movie. I don't know if you guys have ever seen it. Basically, she catches him in the hotel and he's like trying to come back and, you know, wheel her in. I'm kind of getting that type of energy. So maybe that happened with you guys. Maybe you went through their phone. Like I was saying, let's see what else. Let's see what else for my cancers. Yeah, but I feel like you're loving yourself. Like they're they're not going to be able to, you know, control you, control your emotions cuz you're the empress or the emperor for sure. I feel like you're finally making yourself happy, you're finally pouring into your own cup. Maybe you stopped talking to a lot of friends, going out with personal friends, like um, your family, you got distance from your family. Whatever the case is, I feel like now no one can control that but yourself. Let's see what else. Yeah, I feel like um, maybe you're under spiritual attack or this person's going to be um, under spiritual attack because everything that happened, like this is going to be their karma for sure. And they're going to be able to see it. Maybe they're going to even feel like you're doing spiritual attack to them or you feel like you're under spiritual attack because everything's just kind of crumbling down. So we also did get stubborn. So I feel like someone's super stubborn, bossy, selfish. 
Um, this is someone that likes their way and only their way for sure. Um, very, very stubborn narcissist energy is what I'm getting. If you guys do want to book a reading with me or do any spell work or my $5 cash out questions, um, just email me. Let's see what else. Yeah, this is for sure cheating vibes. I'm for sure getting cheating vibes. And I feel like they got caught for sure. Because we did get love affair, third party, hooking up STD, so beware. Um, also an ex. So I feel like you're going to break up with this person. This person had you in a love triangle. The um, This person was unfaithful for sure. Like they were sleeping around. Let's see what else. Yeah. And look how it literally fell out. So I feel like someone is driving by, stalking your social media. Maybe they'll even go to like a tarot reader and be like, are they going to take me back? What's going to happen? Maybe doing like love spells, come back to me spells, forgive me spells, whatever the case is. They're just trying to get you back into um, their circle. But I feel like ever since you guys broke up, um, they have a lot of chaos going on. Or maybe you have a lot of chaos going on. Maybe you just like let go of your job, let go of everything and you feel like everything's kind of crumbling down and you're like, what the hell? Let's see one more card for my cancers. Let's see. Yeah, but I feel like honestly, trust your intuition, trust your dreams. Your, dream, your dreams are giving you visions, warning, signs. Um, like this is how you listen to spirit. This is how spirit knows that you listen to them through your dreams. I feel like your dreams are very vivid. I feel like they want you to heal and have faith that this person just wasn't meant to be. Um, and everything's happening for a reason, right? So that's all I have for you, Cancer. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did resonate, please like, comment, and don't forget to subscribe. If you guys do want to do any of my services, check out the description down below. Um, and I will see you guys in the next one. Take care.